going on? This is Will. Um, I've been itching to play StarCraft on my um, cell phone. Or just mobile. Just want to play it mobile. And um, I'm looking for solutions to this. And one solution is to try <clears throat> just um, using the um, N6, an N64 emulator and um, just uploading uh, a StarCraft ROM um, onto the file and, and just play it that way. Um, the So I'm on Android right now using N M64 plus FC. So this will just, I'm just gonna run through the first, um, one of the first missions uh, as a Terran, just so you guys can see how it looks. Um, this, right now you can see the controls. I'm gonna go ahead and hit A. This will take it to the main menu. And let's, let's just try a single player. Every, I just did the tutorial boot camp right now. Um, so, I'm going to show you guys the first, pretty much the first mission, Wasteland. I think this is the one where you meet, you meet uh, James Rayner. And you'll notice there's some differences um, compared to PC. Like that menu, menu screen. I don't know if you noticed, but those, I believe those characters are from the Brood War campaign. But if... <laughs> missions here should be from the first StarCraft and not the expansion. Let's go already. Um, and you can there's still, there's still, there's some things that are missing like the um, the audio that you you usually would hear here from the um, that machine lady, whatever her name is. That's not there anymore. But I guess I don't need it. I guess I can I can read all this text myself if I have to. Oh, but I do I like the audio from General General Duke. I like his accent. Alright, so the first thing you notice when playing with this is um I'm scrolling scrolling with the cursor with this uh this thumbstick. It's a little difficult and will take getting used to. So if I hold down A hold down A, I should be able to get the cur to select them all. And the one thing I do like is that see the see um I do like these control, these little controls. Move and hold. That makes it a lot easier to um, to move your characters around. Sorry about that. So if I wanna, if I just press the right C, move. But and then B. If I hit B while they're all selected, they will automatically attack anything in front of them, which is how you should play all the time. James is right here. Howdy, boys. I'm Jim Rayner, the marshal of these parts. Cool. Rayner must survive. Oh, my God. Just going to select them. What the? Who is that guy? What was he doing? Going to the bathroom? And yeah, this will be taking. Uh, I um, will take some getting used to. Now, how the hell am I going to separate? Now, I wonder if I just double press on the SCB, it'll select all the SCBs. Let me see if it. No. For duty. Yes, sir. No. For duty. So you can't. Here, yes, sir. <sighs> that for sucks. Yes, sir. So there's gotta be a way to select just SCBs. Ah. Well, I 
grab some of them. I'm gonna move them. Ah, I got them found. Yes, get over here. So this, there's got. I gotta find out how to do this. There's gotta be a way to move just certain characters, or there's gotta be a way to to just select one type of characters because this will take some time. I don't know if I'm going to continue playing StarCraft on my phone like this. I just know... Right now it's kind of hard for me to get on the computer. Since I have kids, I'm always had to be mobile. So my phone... I have to rely on my phone for gaming. So this is why I'm trying to look for ways to play StarCraft on other platforms. Okay, I have my Marines selected. This should be good. I know I'm going to see some baddies up here, so I'm also just have them attack this area. I don't expect to lose because Rainer is pretty overpowered for this map. Now I'm gonna go up, just take them all, take them all the way up here and kill whatever they see. Oh, I saw something. You know what? Fine. I think I saw some bad guys here. Some Zergs. Because four I saw something. One little zerg. Oh! Okay, so see where my cursor is? It was on the mini map. And then I, I, I pressed the B button, and now they're all going over there to oh, attack whatever they see. Obviously, James. Rainer is way too fast, so he's going to clear a lot of it out himself, which is fine. Why is he having trouble getting up there? I don't know. Okay, there he goes. Alright. So I'm pretty much clearing this map pretty fast. As far as controlling your units, that's one way. Let me show you guys how to how it looks when you're mm, trying to build stuff. So I'm gonna move one of the SCVs over here, and you can you see that kind of options the options right there. If I press left, you'll get your build. Sorry about that. I'm trying to babysitting right now. Selecting a barrack, and then he's gonna build a barrack. And let's talk about rally points real quick. If I click on the S command center, there you see the option for rally point. So I press B. So I will highlight. That's it. I just set the rally point. So once this building is done, I should be able to do the same. Uh, why are they all separated? So there are little differences. That's weird that they kind of separate. They kind of were separated. The last of the bad guys, Zer Zergs, are going to be over here, so let's just take care of them. 
Let's see. Oh. Okay. It's going through the tutorial. Marine counter activated. I don't know what that means. Oh, the marine counter. I need 10 marines total. Gotcha. Okay, perfect. So, I will select the barrack. Rally point over here. Build. And that's how it looks like when you're making marines. I'm going to press B to get out of there. Um, Alright. I think is there anything here? No, I can't go over there. Oh, what about up here? Let's search this dark area. Cause why not? Uh I don't think there's anything there. Maybe just one zerg? No, nothing. Uh, this is too Oh. Wait, I didn't set the rally point there. That's weird. I could have swore. I must have clicked something. Rally point. Here, how about that? Also, let's bring any more marines. So it doesn't look like you're going to be able to do like shortcuts, like you know, you set group uh, squads and um, assign them numbers. So that's out of the question. It looks like you're going to have to select everybody manually, which. Which does not sound like fun. And we are almost done with this tutorial. So I think I will continue doing some more missions this way. Um, Oh, and I, that's it, we're done. Very cool, 10 minutes, not bad. And now it's taking me to the next, um, next uh, mission. Okay, just wanted to show you guys how it looks to do, uh, to play it on the Android phone. Um, I'll leave a link to the, um, place where I downloaded the, um, the emulator off the Google Play Store. I pretty much just did a search for N64 emulator and I just downloaded the first one that came up with pretty good reviews. And I'll leave a link to the ROM, where to get the ROM, where I found it. That was a pretty small file. You just have to, uh, it's a zip file, you just have to um, download it, unzip, extract it, and within the emulator, um, locate the file. And that's pretty much it. You can start playing. Alright guys, take care.